everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to more Let's Play God of War Blind for the PS2. In the last episode, we came across Stompy McThrowy Balls. In this episode, we have uh, we have two paths to go down, left or right. Now, normally I would go down the left one because I'm left-handed, but I feel as if the right one is the shorter one. Maybe they lead to the bo both in the same place, I don't know. But in any event... Oh, we have to go down to him. Oh. Is this a boss fight? I hope not. But then again, what's the last boss fight we had? No, it doesn't seem to be a boss fight. They wouldn't do that, would they? Where am I going? Oh, boy. Alright. Um, am I going the right way? Am I going the right way? Man, I don't want to miss anything. I would hate to miss something. Oh, just a Gorgon eye. Alright. Is that it? Is that all there is around here? Or, oh, there's a cutscene thingy. It's a massive door. Emblazoned. Never heard that word before. Emblazoned? Or emblazoned. Emblazoned. <laughs> emblazoned. <laughs> it's like a calzone. With the symbol of the town's oracle, the door shut tight and cannot be opened from here. Okay, so I went the right way. Awesome. Sweet. Now I gotta go back. Tra la 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 la. I really am enjoying this game so far. It's really, it's exactly what I thought it would be, you know. And for the time, it really, uh, it's it's really good. I really enjoy it. I actually am enjoying this better than I am Dead Space Three at the moment. I unfortunately, a couple weekends ago, might have been last weekend. No, a couple weekends ago, I deleted my my save data for Dead Space Three. And ever since then, I just haven't played it. I've just been playing Fire Emblem the whole time because it is just not really worth it. All right, he just closed off that way for me. Thanks, Anus. Sure I can't get past there? Yeah, all right, so let's go left. Probably run into a fight or two. Or he's going to shut the gate on me. Well, then where am I supposed to? Oh, I'm inside. All right. And there's another gate in there. What? What? Okay. Oh boy, alright, I'm just gonna stick to... The large attacks seem to be doing a lot more... Uh, seem to be a lot more useful than the other. But then again, maybe it's just my awesome fighting techniques. <laughs> shove it in his mouth! Oh shit, oh, he shoved it in my mouth. Hey, come back, no, hey, shove it. I'm gonna shove it in your mouth. Hang on, wait a second. Urgh, shove it in your mouth. Shove that, sp that flaming spike in your mouth. I really do enjoy that. The fatalities in this game, it's almost like Mortal Kombat just <laughs> just as a hack and slash when it's actually a fighting edition. I'm gonna shove it. Oh, damn it. Come here, dude. Hey, come here. Come here. There we go. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Oh, yeah. By the way, this is actually relevant to the entire game. They're coming out with a PlayStation 3. It's a certain bundle pack that comes out, I believe. Uh. The middle of this month, actually, middle of March, they're coming out with a PlayStation 3 bundle pack, which is a God of War special. It's a very slim PlayStation 3. It's red. It has 500 gigs hard drive space, and it comes with the um, the um, the new uh, God of War game, which is coming out. Ascension, I think it's called, something like that. And it also comes with the bundle pack of the first three God of War games, which is this one and the, the next two. So I'm actually, and it's only three hundred fifty dollars. So I'm honestly thinking about purchasing that. And if I did, I'd be able to uh, do the not the rest of the let's play. If I were to buy them, then uh, I would do the rest of this let's play at least in PS2 quality. But after that, I'd be able to do the next two games. First of all, I'd have them both, and second of all, I'd be able to do them in HD. So it's really, and I don't have a PlayStation 3. It's one of the, the few systems I lack. I lack a PlayStation 3. I lack um, any Sega system, which I might actually change tonight. I feel like going, to, going and buying a Dreamcast. I really, I've never owned a Sega console in my life. But pretty much just PlayStation 3 and anything Sega is, you know, what I don't own. Are these guys ever going to stop coming out of the ground, or should I just run? No, I can't run. i got to fight them. Okay. Yeah, so I'm thinking about getting a PlayStation 3. If I were to get one, are there any... That's, that's the one thing about PlayStation 3 that I was always skeptical of. 
there doesn't really seem to be any games on it that I really want to play. You know, even with like the PlayStation 1 and 2, other than the, you know, main series games, like exclusive titles, stuff like Spiral the Dragon, you know, Crash Bandicoot, Jack and Daxter, Ratchet and Clank, there was really nothing I ever really wanted to play on it, you know? It really wasn't it really wasn't that big of a deal for me. It was always Nintendo consoles. That was always my, my mecha. Alright, this is getting pretty annoying. Can I stop shoving my flaming spike down their throats and, and do something? Here's another one. It's coming out of the ground. Alright, I'm obviously missing something at this point. So let me just... Uh, do I break this or what? What's the deal? I'm just gonna freeze you or not. Wait, what? Wait, what? What? Oh, I need light for it, apparently. Is that right? I need light? Light, bright, making things with light. Come here, dude. Oh, am I am I missing something? What am I missing? What am I missing? I don't need you to tell me about my blades. I just need to know how to get through this room. Okay, I'm gonna shove this down your throat. Then I'm going to seriously look around for anything that could possibly get me out of this room because this is. I mean, it obviously has to do with with the the cage in the back of the room. There's another one. All right, and this this chest refilled, so that's interesting. Gonna run away from you. See, there's that. There's this thing. Do I hit this thing? Oh, I step on it. Oh. Oh, I get it. Oh, I see what I'm supposed to do. Hey, give me my, uh... Here we go, my Medusa. Now I use it with left... L2. Come here, dude. Come here. Come here, buddy. Stay, stay there, stay. Oh, I, oh, the, it's the button. That's right. I haven't played this in a couple weeks. I apologize. I really wish I could be getting these out, these out more frequently. But just for the simple fact that I worked so damn much and I had to do the four-player Friday session, you know, and shit like that. All right, can I leave? Is that it? Can I go? Shit, he moved. Should have rolled. All right. Well, what the hell? All right. Well, hey, come here, buddy. Come here. Stop with your shockwave crap, Hadouken. Stay. Stay. Damn it. All right. I need more magic. Am I am I missing something? Like, it, I don't get it. Oh, does he stand on the thing? Does it? Does that open the the one to the right as well? I don't think it does. No, it doesn't. Well, then how the hell am I supposed to get out of here? This is stupid. Stay. Stay. Damn it, Helen. All right, um, I'm going to skip ahead until I figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do. This is getting pretty dumb. Hang on, I'll be right back. Got it, 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 got it. Roll. There we go, got it. That was a bit confusing just because it's really hard to see this this pathway here to the right that was kind of, that wasn't very well telegraphed by the game I'm gonna blame the game on that one am I slaughtering innocent victims yes I am don't really mind it that much all right at least I found my way out of the damn room is that a oh it's it's breakable wood with souls in it it's the soul of the tree that was used to build the thing okay mr. Archer I would appreciate it if you stopped it really would as another one? Can I break into these houses? I can't. That, that door just opened. Can I go in here? Hell yeah, I can. What's in here? Anything? Oh, don't tell me I can get into this house, but there's no reason. Is there a chest? Or what's the deal? Can I get into this house? I can, but there's nothing in here. I don't think. What's the point of getting into these houses if there's nothing for me to steal? Oh, here's a box. Hey, I want I want whatever this is. Souls, I'll take it. Did I miss any houses? There's a house here. Okay, uh, I'm the, the. This is the police. We have you surrounded. There's only one guy out there. Shut up and listen to me. Come out with your hands up. Oh, I'm actually in a house with. 
It's like negative view. All right. Oh, I hear a guy screaming, don't I? I think I do. All right. Here's another Medusa with boobies. Lord, I really hope, please, make make there not be very many more boobies in the game. Now, granted, I love boobies. I am a heterosexual male. I'm not gay at all. I like boobies. I like female titties. I, what I don't like is having to edit them out of my video. Turn, turn, pull. Or no, I, I missed it. Damn it. All these archers are pissing me off, too. Long range ass, weaponry ass. Shit, dude. Can you? Thank you. All right. Anything else in the houses that I'm missing? I feel like I'm going to miss something uh, like an eye or a feather. Hopefully not. Nothing in that one. Oh, here's one. Here's one. What's this? Souls or a feather? Feather. I knew it would be a feather. Birds of a feather. Something. Wow. These archers are really. Eh. Heading here. Nothing in this house. How am I going to get to that one up there? That's the question. How? What? Okay, I just jump, I guess. Can I? Oh, I can actually get up here. And there's something in here. It's a chest with... Drumroll, please. It's souls. Da, 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 da. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm getting bombarded here. Remember bombardment in, in school? Anybody ever played bombardment in gym? Where you, you split the gym in half and you're like, okay, half this team, half this team. And you all, it was just a one big game of dodgeball. Bombardment was my favorite game to play. Whenever it was Bombardment Day in gym class in middle school, I would be psyched. Because I was always, I always played utility, which is what I called it. Whenever I played Bombardment in school, I would always play the kid who, I would always play the supplier. And whenever people, because I was never seen as like a huge threat on the gym floor, as you could imagine. So whenever, you know, people, other people on the other team would miss and you know, miss other uh, another person on my team, I would go and get the balls that were thrown and then give it to the people with the arm that could actually throw it. And I was I was the guy. I was the supplier, basically. I, I was I was their pusher man, pretty much. Anything in here other than just soul boxes? No. That was my favorite. Not to mention, you ever notice how you got to do a bunch of like really cool shit in elementary school gym class that you never got to do anywhere else? Gorg and I, my health meter goes up. Sacrifice accepted. Oh, and the eyes spin around. Oh, check that out. And that's a pretty significant boost, too. Okay. Neat. I need that, too. I'm getting my ass handed to me. Is a feather in here? Or just souls? If I can see myself. Like, this, the cool stuff you got to do... It's another feather. The cool stuff you got to do in elementary school gym. Remember that big-ass parachute? What the hell? Was there a Medusa in that house that just followed me out, or... Uh-oh. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Switch to this. Wait, switch. Switch to that. There we go. It's not a cycle-through kind of thing there. When it comes to magic, you have to go left or right. You can't just keep going left or right until you get to one specific one. Oh, Lord, this is frustrating. You got Medusa here freezing me. You got, you know, Captain Tank here hitting me in the face. And then you got the... Oh, I died! That's my first death, right? Huh. And I lost all my stuff. Oh. That's shitty. Okay, well I guess I'll, I'll, I'll I'm gonna, I'm gonna pop ahead real quick till I get to where I just was. That's shitty. Alright, so I'm, I'm right back to where I was. And I'm gonna assume that the entire reason that I died is because this thing right here, that's like a, that's pretty much a fatality move. I'm gonna assume, because I had just gotten that, you know, big health boost. I'm gonna assume when I when I got the health all the way, when I got my last Gorgonai there, it refilled my health. So not only did I have full health, but I, you know, I had just gotten a boost. So I'm gonna assume it. I, I didn't die because of all my my health being gone. I'll have to go back and rewatch it, obviously. But I'm gonna assume that that Medusa move is just pretty much an insta kill, where if she freezes you, you, you turn to stone and. If you don't get out of it in time, then she'll, her or any other enemy will break you and then literally kill you. So that's what I'm gonna. Uh, I didn't think a game. Well, no, I take that back. This is exactly the kind of game that I, I 
believed would have something in it like that. But in any event, we're just making our way down the street here, ransacking all these houses with very little detail. There are no sorts of room adjustments with, or like room differentiations. That's even a word. But then again, what do you expect in these days, day and age, day, days and ages, days? Where am I supposed to go? That's the that's the big question. That is the one on everyone's mind. Can I break these? Feels like I can. My controller is rumbling. Yes, I can. All right, there's a rope here. Can I hop on the rope? No, I can hop down here though. And break wood for souls, tree souls. Can I break that? I sure can. Wonder what the the range on those soul balls are like how far away I can be all right so this is a this is clearly a section where they want you to do something swing on these ropes I assume like this oh hold down circle to swing on the rope oh nice all right I'm gonna assume jump and hold oh hey there's there's things up there hang on stop 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 can I I swing from left to right, like... Oh, I need to get that. I need to get that. What is that in there? Was there one up, up at the at the beginning of the first one, too? No, I don't think so. But, in any event, I need to get that... Oh, there we go. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, oh, there we go. Awesome. Souls. Alright, I can just skip this, uh, the second one. How many souls do I have? That's a good question. 516, I need 3750 for the next one. Alright, so I am nowhere close. Alright. Gonna hop and skip that little gap there. Here's a big house. Can I can I come in for some porridge? Or maybe a sit in your chair? No, I cannot. Maybe I can use your laptop. Can you spare a few bucks for a hobo with swords? I assume these big doors. No, I can't break them. If that slicing noise is any indication, no, I cannot get in these houses. This must be the rich part of the neighborhood. Oh, I smell a cutscene. You smell it? You smell that cutscene? I'm smelling it. Just wait a second. Gotta break the rest of these barrels and stuff. Some water. So I can cleanse myself and the souls of my vic my victims. It's a barrel. It's a God of War barrel time. Um. Alright, let's ascend the stairs. Athens Town Square. Is that like a hub? Hey, there's a there's a chest with a souls in it. With a souls. Can you destroy these? Yeah, you can destroy these. I thought you could. I remember seeing that on an episode of Cheat, actually. You can destroy... Can I get in here? Yes, I can. What's in here? Except nothing. That's cool. I push... Appreciate that game, making me feel like I did something special by finding a secret area, and then there's nothing there to reward me. Yeah, you can... You can destroy these. Oh, shit. What's going on? Oh, crap. Oh, God. Oh, Lord. God, I'm, not, I'm just trying to destroy this statue, guys. Don't worry about me. Just want these souls. I don't know what just happened, but I don't know if the game wants me to focus on it, considering there's all this neat stuff around. There's a staircase here. What's over here? I want in here. It's another chest. Probably souls. Yep, more souls. Look at that. All right. All right, so let's go up. And cutscene? No. Just gigantic trolls from Harry Potter. Troll in the dungeon! How do I turn on my super afro mode? There we go. Afro. Or not afro. Mohawk. Mohawk mode. Tomahawk mohawk. Kill him. Kill him, please. Lord. I just... Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that to you, mister. I apologize. I was going for the big ogre ugly guy. I, but, you know. I mean, I guess if you get in the way, you get in the way. But... I mean, it was unintentional. Do I feel bad about it? Meh. Yeah. Yeah. Die. I don't even need to use my fatality. And another one shows up. Great. Love. Oh, there's another one, too. All right. Am I supposed to kill these guys? Or am I just supposed to run around like an idiot? Oh, look at his butt. Look at his, look at, look at his troll butt. Do I see Wiener? Do they have Wiener? Do they have Troll Wiener? No, it's a low cloth. Thank God. I don't want to have to edit out Wiener, too. Troll Wiener. Troll bogeys. Oh, I can't use it? Oh, shit. 
then roll over here. Don't you worry about... Can I break into here? No, I cannot. Can I break into here? No, I cannot. <laughs> Where can I break into? I, wa I want to break something. That works. That satisfied my, lu my lust for breaking for about two seconds. Guys, I don't, I don't really want to fight you. I just... I'm looking for shit to break. I'm looking for houses to infiltrate. That's just like... Not sure if I've ever mentioned this before, but there was an old show on called To Catch a Thief. Or no, not... No, It Takes a Thief. That's right. There's a show called It Takes a Thief, and it had one of the most intriguing, like, concepts for a show I've ever seen. They took a guy who was a former burglar, very successful former burglar, and they had him... Oh, I need... Oh, I can... Can I sacrifice these people for health? Health? Oh, I do get health from it. That's kind of neat and gruesome at the same time. Uh, a former burglar and the host, who were kind of like buddies, they went and found uh, certain houses that they felt were vulnerable for uh, being robbed. And then the thief would go around and ask these people, hey, you know, can we, can we rob your house? You know, fake, obviously, but, you know, it's for a TV show. And whoever said yes, uh, the thief would like survey the family, you know, whoever lived there for a long time. And once he felt like uh, he had enough information, he would go in and rob the house blind of all of its valuables. And once they did that, once the owners came back, they brought back all the stuff, you know, they showed it and they estimated how much money, you know, how much everything was worth and how much that the thief had stolen and then they they estimated uh, you know how much they would have lost obviously and then what they did was they they brought in guys and they gave him free home makeover for um, they installed a security system for free you know that's like the cost of the show and it was really neat I really liked the concept of the show it was really cool to see I think the, the most interesting part about it was A, how the the burglar would get into the house, you know, he all his various different ways. And sometimes it wasn't even houses. I remember there was an episode where he broke into a skate shop and you know and, and stole a bunch of skateboards and, and skating equipment. But it was really interesting to see A how he gets into the premises and then B all the really unique stuff that, that people have just in their house you know, lying around, ready to be taken. I find that really interesting. And it's really... I'm going on a half hour right now. I wish I could find a save point. Okay, killed him. Do I win? Okay, the, the red... The red is gone. So I have several ways to go. Hey, no. <laughs> Give me your health. Do not run around in a panic. Have some balls and do something productive. Now, I see these chests up here. Can I get up here? I want it. I cannot have it. Oh, there's a rope swing up there. Oh. Well, let's go through. Hey, there's a chick. Come back here, chick. I will not harm thee. Here's a room with a mutilated corpse. Am I in Egypt now? What's going on? Okay. I can have save point. There's that chick again. She's just up there. I'm... I'm not, I'm not gonna hurt you. If anything, you know, with my power, I would, like, violate you sexually and then kill you. I would have, that, that, that seems like something Kratos would do, right? Not to sound morbid or anything, but, oh, I don't need that. Hang on. Not gonna waste it. They said he had an insatiable lust. I don't mean to sound like an insensitive prick when I say that, but... <laughs> Stranger danger. All right, save point? No, it's just a glowing light on the ground. Gotta love misleading game stuff. Very shiny floor, though. I, I give credit to whoever works here and shines the floors. There's another green... Oh, no, it's a... Between blue and green. Give me blue. Big money, big money, no whammies, and blue. Is that it? It's all that's out here? Really? All right, well, let's just go back. Let's chase the chick. Hey, what's that back there? Can I break this? I can't break this. I saw that. Oh, my eye for detail. Just some souls, but, you know, it's better than nothing. It's better than not souls. All right, let's just head over here then. 
go through here. There she is. Hey, chick. I know who you are. I know what you've done. Monster. Wait. Stay back. Get away from me. She doesn't like me very much, so I'm going to have to hunt her down and make her like me. Stay away. <laughs> Either that Don't or... Near me. Keep away. Oh, she fell. I thought she was going to jump herself. Like, There she is, dead. And she has something I need. It's collectible. It's shiny. That means I can take it. It's video game logic 101. It's shiny. You can take it. And here's the save point. Okay. On the next episode, we're going to hop over here, I think, something. And uh, go down there and get the shiny thing. Because I like shiny things. Alright, so until then, I'm Broken Champion. This is Feather. And we're done here.